I don't need the nice towels. I'm okay. No, I I insist, friend. No, I, I will do this, Mr. Carlo. Do you still own the gunsmith? I do. Yeah, I need two. How, how much is an exotic double barrel? Uh, let me take these upstairs and I'm sure I could uh, work out a nice deal with you, Mr. Virgil. If not the exotic, the other one. Just the regular one. The regular one. Yeah, let me, uh, let me pull out my clipboard once I put these up here. I don't know if getting an exotic's very smart, to be honest with you. I mean, I just made myself a Litchfield, so let's talk about not very smart, huh? Okay, well, I don't want a Litchfield. Here, you take this basket, huh? Nice fresh towels. Just set it down. I don't need fresh towels. I air dry. Tell the women to stay away. Yeah, it doesn't even sound like you fucking get wet, actually. This might be your first bath all year, right? One time. No, I, I, I have a creek, Carlo. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Who's that? The Western uh, police officers, huh? Yeah, seems to me he's been a little uh, chaotic. You, and know? you don't say. A lot of people looking for the poor. Geez. You don't fucking say. Yeah, what do you know about that? You know, for the one time in my life, I'm gonna be completely fucking straight up with you. Doesn't make any sense, my friend. I have no clue. Well, if you tell me something, I'll share something with you. Oh, you know, I don't, uh... I don't really have much to... much to give, you know? Well, I mean... Who's who's all these people coming around St. Denis looking for y'all? Honestly, I wish I knew. Somebody else is still up over there on the horse. Okay. How about I throw you a bone no. right now and you're gonna throw me a bone later with all this? I mean, uh, it's not really what I do. I don't really, uh, you know, talk. I'm not asking you to talk. I'm asking you, I'm gonna throw you a bone. And then you're gonna throw me a bone later. Sure, I'm throwing you a bone right now, making you a gun, right? Well, I'm paying for that gun. Yeah, throw your bone, huh? The group that robbed y'all, I'm sure you're aware of this already. But the group that robbed y'all is the Bastards out of Valentine. Never heard of them. Don't lie to me. Never heard of them. Okay. They're the ones that went after your oil. Somebody went after- oh, Angelo did tell me about that. Mm-hmm. We got him... basically confessing to it in Valentine. Well, there's one thing I fucking hate to thief, so... What are we gonna do? Hopefully, the uh, good old karma comes back for them one day, yeah? Huh? Yeah, well, that's your bone. That's what you get from me. So when I come to a poor genie and need a bone thrown, I expect it to be reciprocated. I never agreed to any deal, friend. Well, you know how we operate. Okay, I didn't know if you could. Not without it being uh, like a special edition that never gets to come off. All right, that works for me. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh, I gotta buy ammo, huh? Yeah, if it was anybody else, I'd give it to you, uh, you know, on the house, but yeah, since it's you. Yeah, I'm familiar. It's okay. It's it's your money anyway. <laughs> yeah. It's good to have you, uh, you know, recognizing the uh, value of good old customer service out here, so... Come back anytime, you know? Well, I mean, customer service would be giving me the ammo, but... Yeah, yeah, I understand. You think you deserve the ammo, Virgil? For protecting your city and your family? Yes, I do. You know what? I got something for you for that. You got a canteen yet? I do not have a canteen. There you go. Keep up the good work. Oh, thank you, fella. There's your bone. I don't know if that's the bone, but we'll 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 call it something. Yeah, that's your bone. I don't talk, huh? I didn't say you needed to talk. Yeah, but you know, deal's a deal, right? 
Here's the door. Don't let it hit you on your way out, please. Yeah, all right. Thanks, fella. Be safe out there, friend. Yeah, you too.